a picture uh, of the First Minister when he was Transport Minister visiting one of the yards. He was there that day to mark the halfway point in the build of these ferries. The only problem for Hamza Youssef is that picture was taken at the halfway point, according to him, in December 2016, <laughs> more than six years ago. First Minister, that wasn't the halfway point. It wasn't even the start of this sorry saga. So how is the First Minister, who got us into this mess, going to fix it? Be before the First Minister responds, I will just remind all members that we do not use props in the Chamber. First Minister. Yeah, I mean, it's it, it just a, a sign of Douglas Ross's uh, real desperation, pathetic schoolboy tactics and ability to raise Thank uh, you, members. An inability, actually, to address what is a really serious issue, because I agree with the opposition when they uh, rightly state the anger of island communities that these ferries uh, are, have not been completed. So I give an absolute commitment, an absolute guarantee to those island communities that we are focused, and of course Ferguson's Marines will receive the resources uh, that are required on the back of that due diligence that has been done in relation to the cost. So there are things that we should apologise for and we will apologise for as the government. What we won't apologise for is, of course, saving hundreds of jobs in Port Glasgow at Ferguson's Marine. And Douglas Ross is, is shaking his head. I'm not surprised. He, of course, belongs First Minister, to a party First Minister, that has put... First Minister, if you will just give me a moment... People are gathered here to hear questions put to the First Minister, to hear the First Minister respond. Can we please ensure that that is possible? First Minister. And the reason, of course, why Douglas Ross was shaking his head when I was mentioning the fact that we have saved hundreds of jobs at Port Glasgow at Ferguson's Marine is because he belongs to a party, of course, that decimated communities yeah, yeah. up and down Scotland and left workers on the scrap heap, presiding officer. And...